Here's a list of some of our awards from 94 to 98. My passion for the product doesn't have to go into making it. It just has to go into selling it and drinking it. I mean, that's... <laughs> that rules. So I found a way to make a good tour into a great tour. And the way you do that is start giving away beer. Drinking rogue beer is just admitting that you like quality. I've got a history of working in pubs since before I was 21. The cooler! Come and this is in. kind of the accumulation of that. I came here because it's just, it's the best out there. This is where we carry all our specialty grains and malts. This is where the beer geeks go a little nuts. We use more grain per ounce of beer than perhaps anybody in the industry. Well, why would we do such a stupid thing? because we think that the, the brewers should be allowed to practice their art. This is a crystal ball from color 40. It gives the beer an amber color and a caramely flavor. Left to their own devices, they use the most expensive ingredients available and a lot of them. Then we view the job as the rest of the company to figure out how to sell the stuff. Everything we do across the nation, across you know, the world, and international, all comes out of this facility. We have, what, 26 or 27 different varieties of beer that we produce or have readily available, you know, day in and day out. The number one reason for our success, of course, is the beer. We don't do normal kinds of advertising. You know, you don't see our billboards hanging alongside freeways. Our billboards are our consumers. You know, they will never turn their back on Rogue as long as we keep providing that world-class product, we told them we would, we assured them we would. The brewing process for us starts right here. This is where we're gonna hold our bulk grains. We got well, I've never been restrained on the grain eats that I use, and that's a big factor. We use a lot of uh, specialty grains that are expensive, and that has a lot of flavor. If you get a lot of big multi flavors, you can use a lot of hops and still make it balance. And plus, we have a great yeast strain here that promotes uh, malt more than hops, so you can really push the envelope. You give me one beer a night for the rest of my life, and I'm drinking the Shakespeare Stout. It's won the Beverage Industry International Awards. It's the oldest running competition for beer out of the UK, right? Even bigger is that it's the first time that it came over to the United States. It took it from the UK. It's never been in the United States before, and so we get to hang out with that. It's not that we say our product is world class. It's that others say it is, and enough others have said that in enough countries and in enough judges over enough beers over 18 years that it would appear that that's the truth. Pound for pound, you know, it's the ingredients. We just put more ingredients in our beer than anybody else. You're gonna get a bigger, richer, bolder, badder product. All right. There's there brewers who can make beer using 20 pounds of grain per barrel, okay? Another craft brewer, and one that's distributed nationwide, they use an average of 40 to 45 pounds of grain per barrel. We use an average of 65 pounds of grain per barrel. We use triple what a, a large domestic brewer would use, but we use a lot of that too. Just less water is what it is. We were the first ones in the 22 ounce bottle. Most other craft brewers use that as an introduction package to get sampling on the shelves. We never looked at that as a sampling package. So we were way ahead of our time. People thought we were nuts. You're not in a 12 ounce, forget it, you're gonna fail. A 12 ounce bottle is a commodity package and we weren't making a commodity product. We were making a specialized work of art and you don't wanna put it in a commodity package or you demean by the package your product. I don't know, see, like brutal, like I like the red. We try and do things that are so stupid that nobody else would ever copy it. The 64 ounce jug fits in that genre. Cheers. It's a shared serving, and in terms of helping our retailer, it gives an interesting presence on the shelf instead of one more 12, 18, 24, 36 pack. A world-class product deserves a world-class package. Rogue has always used special packaging, unique packaging, expensive packaging. So we just think their product is so good it deserves a special package. Mm -hmm.